Being resilient is recognizing your limitations. It's recognizing and acknowledging your feelings, where you fall short, and acting appropriately to get the help that you need. Recognizing that, okay, this is hurting me. This is beyond me. I need to do something about this. I need to go and tell my friend what is concerning me, what is hurting me, what is bothering me. I need to go and tell my wife. I need to go and tell my kids. That's you being resilient. You're embracing your emotions, your feelings, and recognizing your limitations and doing something about it. Taking the correct measures to bounce back from that situation. That's the true definition of resilience. Resilience doesn't mean suck it up. Resilience doesn't mean ignore what is bothering you. Resilience doesn't mean ignore when you need help, when you feel weak, when you're in pain. That's not resilience. Whether you're white, blue, black, yellow, it's not fair to be told to suck it up, to be told to just stay strong. The kind of strong that I'm referring to is a different kind of strong. It's the kind of strong that causes your mental health to deteriorate. It's the kind of strong that causes your quality of life to deteriorate. It's the kind of strong that destroys you completely in the end. That's the kind of strong I'm talking about. Stop feeling like you have to put up a front. Stop feeling like you have to convince people that you have everything under control. Stop feeling like you have to prove anything to anybody. Stop feeling like you have to ignore when you feel weak, when you feel vulnerable. Stop feeling like you have to be seen a certain way, you have to talk a certain way or act a certain way. Stop feeling like you have to ignore your pain when clearly you are suffering inside. 